week's vlog, we finished the Tiguan that's been in the past couple of weeks with G-Technic coatings, plus we have a few protection details in. You can check it out straight after this. Hey there guys, I'm Alan and welcome to AIM Details. We bring you car care and detailing rated videos every week. Subscribe and make sure you smash that bell so you get a notification every time we drop a video. And as I say, this week we have the Volkswagen Tiguan back. You've seen it at the tail end of last week. We finished the machining on it, we managed to get it ceramic coated and put together and it looks beaut. Plus we have a rather nice Ford Focus ST in for our protection detail, wheels off and interior service. I'll update you on a couple of other things, but check it out. Good morning. It is Monday the 1st of April. April Fools. Nah, there's gonna be no fools in this vlog. Well, do I say that? Yeah, there definitely won't be any fools in this vlog. I'm not gonna feed you any lies. Morning brief is done. Tasha's still machining the Tiguan, which leaves here Thursday, I do believe. And this morning I've been working on the new website templates, plus we've had some rather large syringes arrive. We've been having an issue recently making the 100mm range easier. We used to use optics, but the optics were getting destroyed too fast, so this time we're going to try some syringes. So what's the plan this week? Today we have the Tiguan in, as I say, for until Thursday. We have a G-Technic inspection today coming in, so it's a lovely Mercedes coming in for a bronze valet and a quick inspection. Then tonight our car gets dropped off. I'm staying late tonight, by the way. A Ford Focus ST, I do believe, for protection detail and some bits and pieces tomorrow. I and mean, then that is it for cars this week. I leave on Friday, so it's mostly going to be giving you guys information and showing you what we're doing with the Tiguan and what happens with these G-Technic services. Time is now nearly one o'clock. I've nearly not enough steps for today. And the bronze valet plus G-Technic inspection is here. Time is now five past ten, and look, I got that step count up. It's going off. Woo, take one's at a pretty good point. Uh, I think you might have me and Tasha on that tomorrow. Might just be Tash. I'll let you know tomorrow. But whoa, the Fiesta's in tomorrow as well. Fiesta. Focus. Focus, Minecraft. <laughs> right, the Focus is in for tomorrow. It's for protection detail and wheels off. So you will get to see that one tomorrow. I'm gonna go home to bed. I'll see you in two.
Good morning. It's Tuesday, the 2nd of April. It's going off. I'm not sure how much B-roll we got, but hopefully I've played it already. We have. The Focus ST in, looking awful dark because of exposure. Come on, Alan, work out your camera control. There we go. SD's in for protection detail, wheels off, and interior. The team have already got it in, well, decontaminated, washed, and in. So now it's time to dry that one. Me and Tash are working on this one. The rear number plates are welded on. So I had to do a little bit of shopping and go get some fishing wire because apparently we'd run out. So let's go and take you through that. Okay, so we didn't record much of that because these things were used. They're like an old number plate sticky I've ever seen. Oh, they did not want to come off, so I ended up cursing. But we got there in the end, it's off, we've cleaned up the rear bits, this is now all detarred. Come on, focus, play the game. So we're gonna have to wool in here, it's quite quite messy in there, so we're probably gonna end up wooling in there, I'll show you that in a bit. I'm gonna pick this off of here, then as you guys know, we're gonna machine this, this lower bit, and then the plate as well. Time is now 15.52. Oh, my steps are poor today. What's going off in the bay? The dig one's heading down as we've got manually handling, manually handling, manually hand polishing. Goodness me, my words today. The handles, and we've got the roof to do on this. As you guys seen in the time lapse, which then died because of the battery, uh, I've done the bonnet, so that has been wooled and refined. Look at that gloss. Who says you can't make white look wet? Front bay chaos, that's the second coat of seal being on there and drying nicely and I do believe the gents are just preparing to fit these bad boys after being coated in C5. We haven't done it in a while but it's time for the tip of the week. Admit it, you've missed it. This week it's center caps, of course if you take them out when you're ceramic coating and doing your thing, put them on now and you can center them because it's nice and easy to get that lined up and if Eon goes oh it's still a little bit squint then I can put my hand behind and turn it and get it lined to how we need it to be. Now, probably the first two miles that this leaves, that'll spin and go all higgledy piggledy. But anyway, there you go, a little tip, help you to line these up.
With the ceramic coatings done, I bet you guys want to see it. Okay, let's drop the music. Don't go anywhere, I have one more thing. So that's the week done. We got the Tiguan, we got the Focus ST, it was a pretty good week here for us at AM Details. But the weekend we also had our second IDA CD SV event here at AM Details. I'm gonna show you a couple of clips because we had four people with us and I managed to get some B-roll and I'll talk over what's going on and what I think the benefits for you will be right here in attending one of these events. An epic thing about this event is we literally had detailers and enthusiasts from four different parts of the UK. We had Gordon from up in Stornoway, Nesh from down south in London, Matt from somewhere around the Midlands area, and then we had Kirk with us as well from down in Fife. And as you can see, these events, even in this time-lapse session that I'm doing here before the exam, you can see we're having really good conversations, introducing each other, what we're going on, and also talking about our different business problems and how we can solve them. Then as you can see here, an IDA CDSV day shows the presentation for the CD, which helps to prepare you to let you know what's going on currently in the industry and update you on some health and safety regulations and really prepares you for the exam and gets your head and the mindset ready for taking an exam, as we know a lot of people are not big fans of taking exams. Then up next you have the skills validated section of the course. For this part of the course, we have you demonstrate your skills. So we'll ask a question like, please show us how you would carry out a machine polishing session on this bonnet with the tools provided on this table. Then us as assessors have tick box sections where we need to see if you're ticking the different criteria laid out by the IDA. Get an 80% pass in both of these and you will get your IDA CD SV ticket. I'm getting more and more people asking me why the IDA or even why PVD here in the UK, both are fantastic, fantastic tools to help you grow and develop your business. They instantly link you with other detailers who wouldn't join these networks if they didn't want to also get to know you. Whether you're an enthusiast thinking of bridging that gap into being a professional or you're professional but feel you're isolated, you've just started and you want to learn from others, then join these networks. The PVD is a UK based one fantastic and we've been supporting it since it started and the idea is the International Detail Association so it is worldwide and we are one of the first chapters to set up here in the UK. If you want to be part of any of them then do look down below and you'll see how you can join them and at the moment of course the idea is getting a lot of pushing on the channel because I am currently doing the training here right now and these vlogs that you are watching are literally weekly vlogs. They're unplanned all we do is video what happens through the day and I show you a documentary of what's going on. They're not car specific stuff. 
I've noticed a lot of people in our chat down below are going, I'm not entirely sure what these videos about. And these are what these videos about. They are a documentary of the car care stuff we're doing every week. If you're looking for car specific stuff, then look for our feature videos, which I promise are coming soon. So do remember if you want to join any of these networks, they are down below in the description. And also come and join us over on our Facebook group. It will be down there too, where you can hang out with us and get to know the AM Details team, fellow AM Details community members, or some of the guys right here on YouTube will also be over in the YouTube chat section. I love nothing more than getting to hang out and know you guys. Thanks so much for watching this one. I know it's a little bit shorter than the usual. I've had to kind of paste these together. We haven't had Eon this week, so you'll get to see that vlog next week. So I've been a little bit rushed, a little bit manic, and I never managed to get much filming done. There's some cool stuff coming up, but it's kind of tying me away from this style stuff. In fact, what I'm going to do is soon I'm going to go and watch my original vlogs that some of you may have been a part of. In fact, if you were, tell me down below. And I want to watch my style back then and see if I can bring a bit of that back. I've got a really cool idea or something to do with the amazing HPI car that we got last year after visiting them at Silverson. I've got a cool idea what to do with that and bring that to you on the channel. And I want to bring the drone back as well. There's huge development happening outside the unit and I think it's going to be great for helping to capture that and really help to take us to the next level here at AM Details. So thank you so much for watching. If you've enjoyed this, then please do check out our other videos here at AM Details. As I say, these are weekly documentaries of what we are getting up to, whether it's admin, car care, or showing you how the unit has developed, and occasionally you get the odd travel vlog too. If you've enjoyed it, then please do subscribe and smash that bell so your phone gives you a cool wee notification every time we drop a video. And quickly, just to throw in at the end of this one, don't forget about our Rupes certified training. We do a two-day event. It's going to be in the square here. Just click it. It'll take you to our website and it'll tell you all about the up and coming July, September and October dates. Get on them fast as already July is half filled and April is done. Ciao.